My name is Sachin, and I'm the engineering manager for the enterprise deployment team responsible for the development of MATLAB production server. MATLAB production server exposes MATLAB analytics in function as a service form in a scalable and fault tolerant fashion. The goal of this demo is to show how MATLAB algorithms can be hosted on MATLAB production server for near real-time data analytics in the field of industrial IoT. The use case shown here is of predictive maintenance to detect anomalies in physical assets. Instead of using a physical device, we will use desktop MATLAB to produce synthetic data. The synthetic data is generated using a model of a motor that was created in Simulink and then run to mimic various operating conditions and anomalies. The entire architecture is deployed on Azure Cloud Platform. Along with the software developed by MathWorks, it uses industry standard software solutions to show how MATLAB analytics can be easily integrated into your enterprise stack. We have used Azure IoT Hub, Apache Kafka, and InfluxDB to store the data. To make the data flow through the pipeline, we have used an Azure function, a Kafka connector for MATLAB production server, and another Kafka connector for InfluxDB. For the data analytics, we have used the pay-as-you-go offering of MATLAB production server on Azure, and for the presentation layer, we have used Grafana to plot the anomalies data. We have used a few simple shell scripts which use the Azure command line interface to deploy all the resources. These scripts also expose important endpoints to interact with this architecture. For example, the MATLAB production server dashboard, endpoints for Kafka cluster, Grafana dashboard, and InfluxDB database. After the scripts are done executing, you can visit the resource group on Azure subscription to see all the deployed resources. So let's now talk about the detect anomaly MATLAB function that will be deployed to MATLAB production server. We are using a micro batch based streaming approach where a batch of streaming data is sent to this function for processing. The Kafka connector for MATLAB production server passes this batch to the detect anomaly function as a timetable. Since the MATLAB analytics is stateful, old state is also passed in as the second input. This function processes the input timetable and returns results for a downstream entity like Grafana to consume. And it also returns the new state, which gets cached by the MATLAB streaming framework. And this new state is passed in as the old state when the next batch of messages is sent to MATLAB, and this process continues. The next step is to package the MATLAB analytics to be deployed to MATLAB production server. You need to have desktop MATLAB with required toolboxes installed. The user written detect anomaly function and its dependencies will be packaged into a CTF archive using the deploy tool feature shipped with MATLAB compiler and MATLAB compiler SDK. This archive can now be deployed to the MATLAB production server pay as you go stack. You should get the MATLAB production server dashboard link from the output of the scripts you have already run. You will upload the CTF using the dashboard. For managing the MATLAB application state, we will use Azure Cache for Redis, which was deployed as part of MATLAB production server pay as you go stack. We will now use a desktop MATLAB session to publish the synthetic data. We created 20 variants of our motor model and captured two days worth of feature sets for each motor in 20 MAT files. After updating MATLAB path and dynamic Java class path with required code, the desktop MATLAB session is ready to publish data to Azure IoT Hub. The MATLAB publisher takes two inputs, your subscription name, and the name of the IoT Hub. It creates a new device if it doesn't already exist and returns the connection string, which is then used to publish the synthetic data. So now we can set up Grafana dashboard to visualize the anomalies data for motors. After following a few easy steps to establish connection between Grafana and InfluxDB, you should be able to monitor near real-time progress. You have now seen how MATLAB-based analytics can be integrated with enterprise-grade applications for real-world scalable data analytics solutions. Thank you.